Welcome guys to another Q&A. Woohoo! So today I am going to again ask and answer a few questions asked by you guys. Let's jump into the questions. Okay, so the first question is what is your opinion on me has known Marcus, Raja, Aaron, Lewis and Umar? Okay, so my opinions on these people. Um, Kai, he is he's a he's a good friend. Um, he adds a little bit of laughter and stuff into the group. Um, Marcus, he is quite quiet, but um, again, he is quite a nice guy. Um, has name. He again is a quite quiet person, but when he laughs, he makes everyone else laugh as well. His laugh is quite funny. Um, Roger, he he's never been like nasty to me or anything, but sometimes his laugh gets a little bit annoying, and he sometimes says like weird stuff. Uh, Aaron again, he has never done anything wrong to me personally. We don't really talk that much, but the times that we have talked. Um, he's always been alright to me, so again, that's, he's alright. Lewis, I mean, I, have, I haven't really, like, talked to him ever. Um, he just sort of stands there and does, like, sometimes he does stupid things. And Umar, again, he, he he's, we've only, like, I've only started talking to him quite recently. But, um, again, he looks... He not, not looks, he is a very, comes across as a very nice person. And I think, yeah, so mostly overall they're all very nice people. Okay, so the next question is, what is your dream holiday and why? Um, to be honest, I don't really have a dream holiday. I mean, getting away from home and, like, school is good enough for me anyway, so... Having a dream holiday isn't like a big thing for me, but um, well, dream holidays not. It's uh, I don't know really. It's just I don't really have a dream holiday because I'm not going away. Like I'm not really too fussed about it. It's good to get away, but you don't. I wouldn't like miss it if we didn't go away so yeah dance to the song mangetas by imran shukat okay so as you guys probably know i'm not really one for dancing but i'll give it a go let's have a look what this is Okay, I think that's enough dancing for one day, don't you? How would you describe Manchester United's form this season? As you guys most probably know, Manchester United, for the last two years, their form has been very on and off. Uh, last year they finished 7th in the table, which was quite bad. But this year they are 3rd in the table. Um, I haven't actually got the table up in front of me at the moment. Um, probably, we've had two, three managers in three years. We went from Alex Ferguson, who was with us for ten years. Not eight, well, there's a lot, not ten years. Over ten years, a long time. And um, we had a sudden change in manager. Now, that is um, very bad for a... Can um, can affect the team very badly, which did happen this time. So I've got the table open right here. Manchester United are fourth. I don't know if this is updated. 
I know because they've played. Wait, wait, wait. One second, one second. Yeah, so they've had Alex Ferguson. They went to David Moyes, who probably, if he had enough time, would have um, kept the. I would have kept him at the job. And then we went to Lou Van Howe, who has brought in a lot of attacking midfielders, but not enough defenders. We brought in one defender. The defense isn't too bad. Um, so let's see at the moment. Manchester United are fourth in the table. Um, they've won 12 games, which is only two less than City and Southampton are above them. So that's not looking too bad. Bearing in mind, we do have to play today. Don't know that score just yet. Um, we've won s 12 games, yep. Yeah. We've drawn 7 games, which is a considerable amount, to be honest. But we've only lost 4. We've only lost 4 games out of 23. So 19 games, we haven't been beaten. And possibly that could only be... be that could be because Chelsea are probably going to go on to win the title because their team is a lot better than the rest. Okay, so one of the last questions is, are you hot when you're cold? Are you yes when you're no? Are you in, then you're out? Are you up, then you're down? Now, with this question, I'm not too sure if he's asking it as an actual question or... Well, of course, it's a question, but I'm not too sure if he's quoting it from a Casey Perry song, which I think I have heard before, something along them lines. But if you're thinking about it as an actual question, I'm not hot when I'm cold, but I'm yes when I'm no. I'm not in when I'm out, and I'm down when I'm up. There you go, learn something different, learn something new every day. And finally, last but not least, is a question I got asked during the week, which was, oh, excuse me, um, which was whether, who I preferred the most, Molly or Sammy. Now, I've been thinking about this question a lot, and I don't want to upset anyone because these videos aren't made for like, they're not supposed to be mean or nothing. Anything I do is a uh, sort of jokey, factual type thing. So, um, um, I've known Sammy the longest, but I get on better with Molly. Um, I won't, I'll probably say... Just to keep the peace, I don't want to fight, so I'll say that I like them both equally. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, next week there will be a another Q&A. Um, so, remember to leave any questions. Um... I'm going to put the question thing up on my Facebook page, which is linked in the description. And um, you just... I normally post the reminder about Thursday, Friday, so you just punch a uh, question in. I'll put it in this video. Again, I don't want too many questions in it, otherwise, because I don't want it to exceed about 10 minutes, so I have to keep this quite brief. So I hope you guys liked. If you did, remember to subscribe for more Q&As, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.